Here's a 1938 Zundap K800. Clearly with the sidecar. This is a four-cylinder side valve. It's kind of hard to tell from the engine configuration, but it's a flat four. Uh, it's, a, it's a flat head, flat four, in that beautiful pressed steel frame. Super Art Deco design with a Stoya sidecar on the side. Period correct, period perfect. I actually think these are far prettier motorcycles than a contemporary BMW. Zundap stuck with the pressed steel frame longer than BMW did. Really, really great motorcycle. It has a fascinating gearbox, too, with no gears. It's an all-chain, uh, oh, multi-gear, multi-ratio chain drive. Boy, aesthetically, and the lines is spectacular. It really has a striking appearance. You take that black and white theme. And Look then at the price. The, Hello. Yeah, right. <laughs> Wowzers. Yeah. The reserve came off, I think, around 110, 120, right in that range. Mm. 190, 190, just give 200. Yeah, but the present you were talking about, John, is just remarkable. It just has it, yes. Nearly, uh, nearly $200,000. Look, Look at this. It's a world record for a Zundop K800. I've actually test ridden one of these in the, Al or in the uh, Bavarian Alps. Well, if you were at the Quail last year, you would have seen this there because it got first place in the other European category. Well, I'm the MC, and I help give out the awards at the Quail. So I did see it and congratulate the owner. Oh, my goodness. Wow, he's out. That young lady just paid $170,000 for an unbelievable Zundap. My goodness. That's among our top sellers of the day today. We'll be back with more in just a moment.